recent snowstorm saw this driver stuck on the railroad tracks. Then she leapt into action. Hannah Jewell is live in Wauwatosa with a look at a rescue. It involved a lot of people, huh? Hi, Ted. And yes, you remember how snowy and how horrible the roads were last Tuesday morning, right? Well, this woman was on her way to work. She was going over the railroad tracks behind me when she got stuck in that snow in a dangerous spot. I love helping others. MCTS driver Shanika Merrill was driving her regular route. The roads was terrible. Navigating through a snowstorm early Tuesday morning. Well, most of them wasn't plowed out. Approaching 68th and State, Merrill saw a driver stuck in a dangerous spot. When I was approaching the stop, I had noticed a car sitting on top of the tracks and I saw hazard lights. So I'm like, is her car stuck? Something wrong? Somebody needs to help get that person off the tracks. So that's very dangerous. Leaving passengers on the bus, she walked to the car. She had raised down her window and she told me that she was stuck and she'd been there for about like 20, 30 minutes. I was like, oh my God, no, we need to get you off these tracks because it's dangerous. The stranded driver was on the way to her job at a local hospital and was about to call for help when Merrill offered to push. And I asked the gentleman, I said, can you help me, sir? One by one, riders on the bus joined in, freeing the car. So many of our great drivers don't hesitate to just stop and help. And uh, in this case, you know, it could have been a life or death situation. So we're just so proud of her for stopping. The woman later wrote to MCTS saying this lady, bless her heart, gathered everyone she could and they pushed me out of the snow. You are the reason I got to work today to save lives. A nice message there, and you may remember another MCTS driver was recently praised for her quick thinking, rescuing a toddler found running across an overpass in Milwaukee. Back to you. It's a good group of people. All right, Hannah, thanks very much. Well, this